to dive right into case study one on domestic divorce, uh, succession, and community property rules. So in this case study, Rosa is married to James, and both are domiciled as citizens in the Philippines. James holds 70% of a Philippine local trading company, land building, as well as financial assets. James also holds real estates, financial assets in the United States. And James is definitely aware of the importance of succession planning and has established a Hong Kong trust to hold 30% of his Philippines trading company, his Hong Kong trading company and financial assets. Now, from this slide, we can see why he's taking steps to plan for his domestic uh, matrimonial and succession planning. James' daughter, Emily, is in the US, um, US citizen and resident, and his son is in Hong Kong, permanent resident, but retained his Philippine citizenship. 